the process of becoming a pharmacist in Ireland has undergone some significant changes and it has left a few aspirants confused. So are you too seeking some clarity on Ireland's updated pharmacy registration process? Well, if yes, you have reached at the right video. Hello everyone, welcome to Academically. In today's video, we will explain the updates in the PSI registration process for pharmacists for your better understanding. But before we begin, I would ask you to subscribe to our channel so that you never miss an update about the PSI exam or any other pharmaceutical exam. Ok, so now let's begin. One of the most important updates is the removal of the adaptation period from the PSI registration process. Earlier, it was mandatory for pharmacists to undergo an internship ranging from six months to three years before receiving a complete registration. It was earlier required to help them learn all about the Irish pharmacy system, but it is no longer a compulsory now. And with this, you can save time and effort and the lengthy registration processes can be reduced. Now, let me tell you the updated PSI registration process step by step. So, step number one, submit the application form. You start by completing and submitting the third country qualification recognition, which is TCQR application form provided by the PSI. Now, alongside this form, you will need Certificate of Identity form, Statutory Declaration form, Academic Transcripts and Certificates sent directly from your university and regulatory authority. Now, once everything is ready, pay the application fee via electronic transfer and email the documents to non-EU root at the rate psi.ie with the subject line TCQR application. Now moving on to step number two, which is internal review for validity and eligibility, which is a stage one of the evaluation process. Now in this stage, the PSI will conduct an internal review to verify the eligibility. Next is step third, which is holistic assessment, which can be called as stage two. Now, independent assessors will evaluate your qualifications and experience. They look at three factors. Number one, input components, academic qualifications and practical training. Number two, quality components, which is accreditation standards of your home country's pharmacy program. Number third, output component, your postgraduate education, work experience and professional development. Now, after this process, your pathway will split and you will be asked to choose. Now, path A, if your qualifications meet Irish standards or path B, if deficiencies are identified. So, with path A, you'll receive a certificate of qualification appropriate for practice and proceed directly to registration. However, if you are redirected to path B, you'll need to address them by undergoing an aptitude test at stage 3B. Now, step 4 is the aptitude test, which is stage 3B of the process. The aptitude test consists of two main components, the multiple choice questions, which is MCQ section, and the Objective Structured Clinical Examination, that is OSCE. The specific components you need to take will depend on the outcome of your assessment. You may be required to take only the MCQ or only the OSC or maybe the both. MCQ covering pharmacology, pharmacy practice, basic sciences and pharmaceutical calculation while OSCE testing practical skills in real life pharmacy scenarios. Now step number five or the final step is the certificate of qualification appropriate for practice that is stage 3a and 4b so once you complete all these stages the pharmaceutical society of ireland will issue a certificate confirming that you are eligible to work as a pharmacist in ireland and with this you are ready to move forward with your pharmacy registration and find a job in ireland and here's a flow chart explaining the steps on your screens now, completing these steps will help you land a job in Ireland. So, you still have doubts about the procedure? Our experts at Academically can explain the procedure to you in your language and in the easiest words. All you need to do is 
visit academically.com and book a free counseling session with our experts. Fill out the form and we'll reach out to you as soon as possible. Okay, so that was all for today. Hope you liked our video and had a good time grasping all this knowledge. You stay tuned to our channel for more such videos and do not forget to like, share and subscribe before you leave. Okay, so bye-bye. Take care.